Good morning and welcome, welcome to this week's Vandal Vlog video. You join me on a Friday on a Friday morning at uh, just gone 20 to 8. I'm on my way to the scrapyard, it opens at 8 o'clock and I need to get this van emptied because we've still got everything in here from last week and uh, I'm sick of the sight of it and it's in my way. Uh, and we're going to go and get weighed and paid and see what sort of moolah we get. So I'll see you guys there, I'll see if I can pull over somewhere quickly and just show you what I got. Picked up some more stuff, picked up a boiler. Uh, if not, I'll see you there and uh, you'll see it as it comes out of the van. Then we can go and finish this job and I can get done for the week and uh, go and have some fun. All right, I'll catch up with you guys momentarily. We're at the scrappy. She's like, oh, she's heavy. 3,250. Look at all this. There's loads of stuff in here. Short and light iron. No one's here yet, I'm early. There's a boiler I found. Any old irons? <laughs> right, let's get weighed and paid.
everything else is short still. And there's a lot.
we got weighed and paid. So we had light iron, we only had 360 kilos at 150 pound a ton, that's 15 pence a kilo for 54 pounds. And short cast, we had 280 kilos for 225 pounds a ton, that's 22 and a half pence a kilo for 63 pounds, which gave us a final sum of 117 pounds on the dot. Not too shabby. And we've still got some stuff in the back. There's a bucket of non-ferrous. Uh, there's a boiler. I got off Fander One and Kevin uh, the other week. We still need to scrap that out. That is an aluminium side table. A TV. This, I believe, is just some sort of stainless or chrome finish aluminium. And this is the only thing I've picked up this week. The question is, What's inside? Let's find out. Is it the good stuff? I'm sure last time I had one of these, it was a um, copper rack. So I saw GD and Suns had one, and then I picked one up a couple of days later. So it was a copper lead wash rack, but it's quite heavy. So I'm thinking aluminium. Here we go. It's good news, people. It's good news. Yep, that is a that's a, that's a Yeah, baby. Oh, I've got another one in there somewhere. There it is. It's down there. Two of them bad boys. That's a score. Lots of coppery bits in there, brassy bits, and there's some lovely brassy bits on here. Check that out. All right. I gotta go and finish off a job and uh, get home. I guess I might scrap these out or I might just totally ignore them and go scrapping. <laughs> it's like, well, I don't know. I don't know, we'll see. If I don't go scrapping this evening, I'll catch up with you guys in the morning. All right, just finished, we just finished that job. Let's pick that up from the guys across the road. There's all the aluminium I got off that job. Some big bits of alley there. They're right up, they do. Nice and clean, just a couple of screws in them I just need to take out. That was a lead off a job. Got be a 20 kilo there, I guess. It's me lead wash rad. It's me aluminium rad. That's aluminium, I need to take that apart. That is my leaf blower, I need for Monday off Alan. Thank you, Alan. Scrap that TV out. What else is there? That's it really, got a few bits and pieces up here. In there is a copper radiator and some copper rads. That's about it really, that's all I've got to report. Get that TV scraps out, get these boilers done, and that's it. Ready for the weekend. So I ain't doing nothing else today. Right, see you guys in the morning. Good morning! How you doing this morning? We're out on the hunt, and I'm taking Kunt's advice. That's, you couldn't see me. And we're not looking for non ferrous We're not looking for copper. We're not looking for brass or boilers or big fat radios or anything like that. No, certainly not. We don't want none of that stuff. Right, let's go and see if we can find what we don't want. Woo! I've got to stop doing that woo. What was that? Nothing. Well, as you can see, it is considerably brighter. I haven't found anything in the last... 
25 minutes, half an hour. There was absolutely nothing. Not even a plug. Not even a plug. Oh, that is a nice tipper there, my friend. Oh, yes. What we've got around here? A sofa. I don't want a sofa. I know you guys can't see anything, but neither can I. You're not missing out on anything whatsoever. What is that? Oh. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Not even copper or brass. You know, the stuff I'm not looking for. Well, we'll keep trying. Shut up, man. That's some bits of metal here. I'll take them. Got nothing else. It has to be the noisiest metal in the world. Did I, did I do the door? Did I do the door? As you can see, I didn't do what I was going to say I was going to do. And the only thing I found recently is uh, this copper radiator in there. I'll take some clean steel. Poo pipe still in there as well. And some aluminium or aluminium, as it is also known. Da -da -da. That's all right, that'll probably go as shearing, maybe. Um, let's get you up there. Safe and sound. Yeah. You can't see it, but um, I've still got the two boilers to do, still got the aluminium to do, and I've still got ATV to do, yes. <laughs> we'll get there eventually. Right, oh! Shut up, man. So there's a couple of chairs, but I don't know if they're iron or if they're plastic. Imagine they're iron. Oh yeah, they're iron. They stack. A bit not good. Oh dear. It's looking like a chair kind of day then. Yeah, a cast. No cast, I'll take them. Clean metal. I'll take any clean metal. I'll take a whole van full of the stuff. They're just bloody awkward, aren't they? Right. Let's have a quick look over here. What's in this box? Christmas decorations. I'm good, thanks. is looking like a chair type of day. Shut up, man. A chair, a scooter, and an ironing board. It's nothing else, so I'll just take it. Clean that up, no? Clean it up somehow. Cut the pitch tires, a scooter, and a ironing board. Ah. 
now a clean ironing board. I'll have to do. He'll just have to do, lad. Let's have a little butcher's here quick. Sometimes you get something, sometimes you don't. something I suppose. Oh. Of course I didn't. I've got something in my foot as well. well clean steel is better than no steel. Stay. I'm sure we saw something here. Some few bits and pieces. Oh, is that it? A bike wheel. I'm sure we saw a hoover or something. Clean, that goes short, I guess. What a load of rubbish. Got the scrappy bits here. about it. Plastic bits off, it goes clean. Clean short. It's gonna be a short kind of day again, is it? Well, I'm afraid, guys, that is it for this week. It's dead out. It's uh, yeah, it's been quiet. It's just a day of chairs. Oh, well, you win some, you lose some. I had a pretty decent week this week, wages wise, roofing. Uh, next week I've got another roof to start, maybe two. So yeah, but uh, the only thing is it's going to be raining next week. It's uh, Monday to Thursday, it's supposed to be wet. So I don't know. I'll tell you what I'll do. I'm going to go up the road. I'm going to see if the car wash is open. Go and give Big Mama a shower. And then I'll pull over and I'll show you what we haven't got. <laughs> it's not much. I'll catch up with you guys momentarily. I'm afraid that's it. It is the end of another Vandal Vlog video. Only a short one this week, guys. I know, it's pretty, pretty pathetic. But, you know, I've just been out for four hours and I've found absolutely nothing. Well, found some stuff. We found some satellite dishes. Pretty hefty. There goes Sheeran. Uh, we found an ironing board, a scooter, and a multitude of chairs, which I presume are all iron. Oh, aluminium. Or aluminium, as it is also known. I knew that'd be steel. Steel. Oh, so they're aluminium. 
Who would have thunk it? Yeah, they are. Aluminium. Cool. Down here. That's this copper rod. It's not a lead washer rod that down there, is it? I don't know. We also found a bike wheel. Anything else in here? It was already in there. I need to get them border scraps out bit on. Look at them coppery bits in there. And the lead washer rod. It's always nice. Uh, I've got this aluminium. And a load of poo pipe. Just a lot of poo in it. Some nice bits of aluminium. Right, that's it. I'm afraid that's it. Oh yeah, look at Big Mama. Nice and clean. Oh yeah, we're cleanish. It's got some marks in there. I can get off fingerprints and such. Just need to do the inside. Right. I'm afraid that is it, guys. So uh, obviously I was working all week. I've got potentially a busy week next week, but it's going to be wet. It's going to be wet from Monday to Thursday. So on Monday, I need to start a job in Winchester. I've got an EPDM flat roof to do. Um, the guy I'm doing that for, he's put me in contact with another contractor. He needs a roofer badly. Uh, he's got a job lined up for me. Um, Tyler might have some work lined up for me as well. So regarding Tyler, we're still we're still good mates. We're still working together. We've just gone as separate entities. So he's working with his uncle Kevin. So he's happy to do pointing and all that sort of stuff, whereas I'm not. You know, I like to do roofing and all that, you know, I like the cream. So, uh, yeah, we're still good. So I'm doing some work for him. Actually, the last job that I've done this week was, was for Tyler as well. So uh, I haven't made a video, but I shall put up some photographs at the end for you guys to have a little mooch and uh, see what you think of it. Uh, pretty decent job. Yeah, it was good. So, yeah, we'll have to see. If I can get a midweek video up, I will do. But if not, I won't, obviously. And uh, I'll see you next Sunday. Until then, thanks for being cool, thanks for being kind, and uh, I'll see you wonderful humans next time on Vandal Vlogs. Love yous. Let's go home and have coffee. <laughs> Guys, before I go, I just want to do a quick shout out to Polly Prophet. If you guys wouldn't mind going over there and subscribing him, he is a street scrapper from Australia. And uh, he's been working really hard on his videos. He's done really well. At the moment, he's on 918 subscribers. So if we could give him that little push just to get him over that 1,000 subscribers and get him monetized, that'd be really, really cool. So if you guys could do that for me, I would really, really appreciate it. Go over, check out your boy, Polly Prophet, and uh, tell him the vandal sent you. And it's, uh, it's giving that last little push. He's a, he's a good guy, and uh, they've had a hard time in Australia with lockdowns and all that sort of stuff, but he's kept going, and he's kept going, and uh, he also likes to go out on, the, on a bicycle once in a while. This is a bit of the vandal, you know me. So go and check him out, guys. Polly Prophet. Woo! Right, love yous. See you later.